welcome to Linux help in this today's session we are going to see how to create insert modify update and delete databases and collection in mongodb like many relational databases mysql uses structured query language the mongodb query language mql makes it easy for developers to query the database a comparison of its syntax with sql is provided in documentation now I'm going to log into the Mongo shell. Use this command Mongo. I'm clearing the screen. Now I'm gonna create database in the name of Linux help. Database created. Next I'm going to create a collection in Linux Linux help database in the name of subscribe We successfully created a collection. Next, I'm going to list the collection by using the following command. Successfully created a collection in the name of subscribe. Next, I'm going to enter the data in the subscribe collection by using the following command. giving the name name is John and I'm giving the age age is 25 and I'm closing the array and give enter inserted now we can see the data inside that subscribe collection you give, give the subscribe and find see here it will shows the created data inside the collection in the name of subscribe next i am going to update the collection by using the following command name name is John and then I'm going to change the age for that I'm using an array use the dollar and type set for modifying something inside the created data now I am changing the age age I am changing to 25 to 30 
and I'm closing the array and click enter here you can see it is modified and go to the data here you can see the modified age is changed next we are going to see how many data's count are there in the collection section for that i am creating another one collection by using the following command in the name of like successfully created another one collection now i am going to list the connection by using the following command you can see like and subscribe next i am going to show the count of the of those collections if we are having a uh, above 100 or uh, thousands of collections we didn't know how many count is there so that i'm going to show how to find out the count of the collection here in subscribe collection we are having one data inside that collection and same thing i am doing in like collection there is no collection data inside that collection so it is showing us zero now i'm clearing the screen now we can see how to drop the collections and databases first we are going to see how to drop the collection by using the following command type the collection name before that I am going to show you the collections we are having two collections in that I am going to drop this like collection enter the collection name first and then type drop this means the collection is deleted I mean drop let's see the collections see here subscribe collection only is there next we are going to see how to drop the database first I am going to show the databases for that and the command show databases here I'm having the nest and Linux help here I'm going to drop the database Linux help is drop next I'm going to drop the Dinesh database for that we need to go inside the database use Dinesh now I'm going to drop Dinesh now I'm going to drop the database in the name of Dinesh
here we can see the database is dropped let's check by using the following command here you can see the linux help and the database in the name of this both are dropped with this the process of creating databases and the collections and dropping the databases and collections and updating the databases has come to an end thank you for watching this video and if you like it please subscribe to our channel to learn more tutorials visit www.linuxhelp.com and if you have any queries mail us to support@linuxhelp.com